ladies and gentlemen, Noel Nolte Johnson here coming to you live from Coburn Ice Arena as we start the second period of the annual 20, well, the 2023 annual ice hockey tribute match between the Australian Defence Force, the Ice Guardians, up against the Crocs of Coburn. And as we resume, right on the end of the first period, Ben Ballantyne, the scorer for the Crocs, sees them with a one-goal advantage. Straight back into it now, end-to-end ice hockey. We've seen it all through that first period. Fast pace of foot here. Oh, he's dive Skidworth. Came out of his goal. Tried to make the diving save. And as a result, all of a sudden scores a... Scores a tied, one apiece. We'll pick up... We'll pick up the scorer when we can. This is three Adam Blowers out there. And none of them seem to look like him. Straight back into it now. Guardians. Only as far as halfway, Crocs pass back. Bit of a check, not paid by the refs. Oh, yes it is. Well, I just chatted to him during the break and Chris Kostopoulos into the penalty box. Two minutes. Crocs with the power play advantage here now. (laughs) Deflected back. Crocs with space and numbers, but one of the blowers that's not comes in for the Guardians, pops up to cross for the Crocs. Throws a foul from the ADF. Lindsay gets a bump on the the ref. In AFL, that would get him three weeks. Who got the goal? Who got the goal? Hey, we got Mark. We got set down. Well, as we switch back up this end, 97 was the goal. In my experience, I think that might be either Hyde or Wheatley. Long shot stopped by... Skip worth that. It's a reminder to Facebook and YouTube and Insta 
that music incidental in the background. I say that with a smile. Done for icing there and to end with our touch. So it'll go back. Try again. Face wide across the face of goal there. Linda Vogel, long range, cut off. Stop by Skibworth under attack this second period, the crop. Good pressure from both sides. Ballantyne, Ben Ballantyne, the goal scorer for the Crocs. And he hands it off. He'll get the assist there. And that, by the look of it, was number eight. Confirm that in a moment. No, number three, I'm going to give that to last. Two one in favour of the Crocs. The Guardians with some work to do here. Christopoulos released from the box. Tried. Big pack around the front of the goals there. Shot from long range. Top right. Intercepted by Skipworth. Back of the net. Back now for the Guardians. Defense of the Crocs working well at the moment. Conceded one early, but they pegged that back. And as a result, Coburn Crocs lead 2-1. Action by Skidworth. Crocs. Well, they had the numbers, so I'll come back. Whistle from a long way off, Owen. Referee there. Not sure who that song was referring to about being creepy and spooky. Once again, the defence for the Crocs. Oh, perfect pass to a wow. Harper there, assisted by the wayward pass. You can hear the celebrations there. And why not? Because one of the Adam Lower triplets gets a goal and all of a sudden it's two all. Ten minutes gone, second period.
got in. That should come back for Iceland because it got past two. Nine thirty left on the clock. Oh, we're going over the far side again. Keeping the cameraman on his toes here. To all, 9.15, second period here at Coburn Ice Arena. Anzac Day, tribute ice hockey match. Skipworth there, just enjoying a chat with the fans in the restaurant. No damage. Big stack behind goals now. Crocs comes. Good pass inside. Not able to find the back of the net though. So Gunder Vogel. Told to go. Deep in the Ice Guardians offensive zone at the moment. Crocs now. Wow. Guardians push back. They've got the numbers in defence. Off the bar. Sidebar there. Ball tucked in against the boards. Find some inquisitive heads. Coburn Crocs. Welcome back, wherever you are. You're here with me, Noel Nolsey Johnston, coming to you live on the Community Sports Show for this annual Anzac Day Ice Hockey Tribute Match. And we've got a ripper here at the moment. 6.56 left on the clock, second period. Scores tied, 2 all. But the man on his right finds him, gets past the defence there for the Guardians, who clear. Wheatley circling. Now spinning down this right-hand side, Skipworth. Well, you can't get any more desperate than that. It's the Ice Guardians. Regain possession, center ice. Neverman. Can't retain possession, still loose. Notable changes there simultaneously. Good to see you there, Kate. I did let him know you and the girls were watching, so big shout out to you and thanks for joining us. 5 17 left, second quarter or second period, Nolsey. If I cross my sport references, I apologise, viewers. Here on the Community Sports Show, we take all sorts of local sports to you, our global audience. And this Saturday, 
round one of the lacrosse WA season. But for now, we've got a ripper game on our hands. The ball goes behind the pads. Even if I was up in the cherry picker, I would still be blocked out there and I could sneak <laughs> out, but... <laughs> Some smiles on the faces. So, well, another penalty, another power play opportunity here for the Crocs. They haven't been able to capitalise on the two they've had so far. What can they do with this one? Fuck, back into play now, deep in that back corner shot from long way out and Harper down on the knees rebound Cleaned up in the back by the Crocs. They come broadcast side. Seemed to be a nice in. Just inside that defensive blue line. Two minutes 30 left. Scores, two all, 50 seconds left on the power play. On women, that side. Valentine has won. And that is why you wear a helmet. <laughs> No one. Nelly taking out the team manager for the Crocs. And I have to confess, if the glass wasn't there, it was heading my way too, so... Puck. Back of the goals. Vinder Vogel. Is it in? That should be an icing and come back. Despite the desperate attempt there for the Guardians, unable to get back. One oh five left on the clock. No, no penalties in play at the moment. Deep in the Crocs offensive zone. Well, rest have found another. Good to have you with us there, Mickey. Uh, with 35 left on the clock. And down. Long range shot there. Far side, 12 seconds. Called for it inside. Time will beat both teams here. And with that siren, 
It is the end of the second period here at Coburn for the 2023 annual Anzac Day ice hockey match proudly brought to you here on the Community Sports Show. Now, I'm just looking to my left because it looks as though they're going to cut the ice again. So, one more period to go. We'll cut the ice and be back in 10 minutes' time, viewers. Don't go anywhere. We'll be back as soon as play resumes here on the Community Sports Show. A few heads shaking. But uh, the end of two, it is two apiece. We'll be back in eight or nine minutes here on the Community Sports Show as Albrecht takes a break. We will too. We'll see you back here real soon. <laughs> 